already look up on the board? Who can read what that says? What are the three words Pain, that are circled? Pain, pair, share. There you go. Thanks, Wayne. That was Pain, pair, share. Okay, so who's done Pain, pair, share before? Nope. It's nice because it doesn't require you guys to write anything down for the do now. It doesn't. But, okay. no, it doesn't. Thank you. Okay. You're welcome. struggled with in our past. So I want you to think about, I'm going to give you 30 seconds to think about something that sometime in your life you've struggled with. So I know for me, I have not been good at everything that I've done in my life at all. Um, and there are also other things besides, you know, skills in school and in sports that I've been bad at. I had a really hard time when my parents got divorced. I struggled with the things that my family was going through when my dad went to jail. It was it was a really tough time for me. I didn't handle that well. If I look back on it now, that was a time in my life where I was really struggling. So think about a time for the next 30 seconds that you struggled with something. An issue in your life, a class at school, something. And then we're going to turn to a neighbor and share a little bit about that. So think of something that you're, you're willing to share with a neighbor. Keep it in for a bit. Oh, by the way, Miss McDaniel, I like your shoes. Thank you. Yeah, guess why I'm wearing, why am I all decked out in ASU gear today? What games this weekend? ASU! ASU! Yeah, go Devils! What? They're the school of colors, maroon and gold. Nothing's football. So you wear you wear ASU shoes, but not Skyman. Okay, turn to partners and share. Find a partner. Share about the time that you've struggled with something. Who's sharing? Who's working together? Can you guys work together doing you and Kevin? Thank you. You can share with me.
So she is obviously having a lot of trouble. And why do you think she's struggling so badly with Annie right now? Jacob? She's not used to Annie. Yeah, she's not used to Annie. <laughs> Excuse me. She's not used to Annie not only being around, but what type of attitude or what type of things is Annie like pushing her to do? Teresa? Like she doesn't let her do whatever she wants, so she's pushing her to like Yeah. Her own. Annie is holding Helen to way higher expectations than she's been held to previously, right? What do Helen's parents allow her to do? What are some things that Annie doesn't think are appropriate that Helen's parents allow her to do? Jacob? Like take food out of other people's plate? Yeah, she walks around, kind of puts her hands in everyone's plate at the dinner table. Nick? When she has a hissy fit, they just give her what she wants at the point. Yeah, she throws a fit, and what do they do to shut her up? Give her what she wants. Yeah, what she wants, or they give her candy or sweets or things to kind of like coddle her and and what do they what is the attitude they have toward Helen how do they view her uh, Jacob as a, like a delicate eggshell as a little egg yeah as Annie said and she's not an egg she's a child right they pity Helen and so that is something that she's struggling with to overcome this attitude of being pitied all the time and all of a sudden now she's being held to these high expectations by Annie which do we think it's a good thing yeah. or do we think it's a bad thing that Annie's pushing her it's a good thing it's a good thing yeah because eventually what's going to happen Helen's going to start responding to yeah her. Helen's going to respond and communicate and she's going to have a higher quality of life but is that process going to be easy no no, no it's going to suck really bad yeah they're going to She's not going to enjoy the process of learning language and learning to accept Annie as her guide through life, as her access point. Who can share with me, either there or if your partner's okay with it, their partner's struggle in life? Nicholas, you want to share yours? Yeah. Okay. My struggle is not beating the crap out of my brother. Okay, so, yeah, I know that you've told me before, you and your brother get into some pretty intense arguments and they turn physical sometimes and so yeah is that what kind of struggle like what do you struggle with most in that relationship uh, keeping my fist in my pocket okay so not not, not fighting back not yeah either. not physically getting involved in, in the yeah. fight good who else has one wayne struggle with my depression okay you struggle with your depression so that's a disability Very too good. right yeah. Yeah, so every day it's a struggle that Wayne has to overcome to even get himself to come to school and to, you know, get himself to... It's hard to, to stay in school. Yeah, yeah, it's hard to stay in school because he's battling with these different things and different disabilities. We all have different stuff going on, but Wayne has, you know, depression that is really disabilitating to him sometimes. Yeah. I, I just live with this because my, 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 my problem is kind of personal. Okay. So I told, I in the past, I had a problem with liquid medicine. Okay, so you had a hard time swallowing liquid medicine. Yes, it tastes, all of it tastes terrible. It doesn't taste good. Right, so what did you do? Like, what was the, what was the solution that you had? What I decided was, instead of liquid medicine, to what 